Deep Game, a testbed for multi-agent systems at deepgame.org. Current research in models for multi-agent systems coordination emphasize cognitive and social aspects of the interaction. Rich enough use cases are urgently needed to build complex simulations that do not require oversimplifying these interaction models. For that purpose, a testbed based on the strategy board game diplomacy is being developed at the IAAA. Diplomacy situates the player in Europe at the turn of the 20th century, with the goal of conquering the continent. Each player is in charge of the armed forces of a major European power and must decide which battles its various units should fight. Diplomacy is played by seven players that compete but that also have to cooperate to be able to win. Cooperation is articulated by dialogues among the players. These dialogues may be public or secret. Players negotiate to settle alliances. They select whom to ask for help, what information to disclose, what offers to make, how to argue to get information about other agents' goals, and so on. Let's see an example of the possible actions over the period of one year from the perspective of France. We can't conquer Piemont because Venezia is also trying to conquer it. It's a nonsense for both to fight for Piemonte. I propose you an alliance against Germany. You will attack Germany from the west and I will from the south. Together we can defeat this power. Does France trust Italy? Will Italy honor its promises? Players need to resort to their previous experiences to make the right decisions. That is, does France have now a better option? No. I am going to accept Italy's deal. I will attack the Ruhr. After decisions are made, players observe the result of their actions and may update their view on the other players. During a game, many agreements are signed because a game spans over several years. The consequences of our actions may impact future alliances or betrayals. In this case, it looks like Italy is respecting the deal because it is attacking Tyrolia. Players fight in different fronts, and the decisions made for each one are interrelated. For instance, it looks like England desires Brest, and therefore France has to keep an eye on it. Anyway, France is already positioned for a coordinated attack with Italy against Germany. But... Blast! Germany is getting reinforced. This is now or never, Italy! Let's defeat Munich! Yeah! Let's do it! What the hell? Germany annihilated France attacking army. Where are you, Italy? You? Yeah, it's a trap. Italy put France a trap. Perhaps it is a Germany ally, or maybe it is just being selfish. After France's error, Italy is now going to conquer Marseille. France did wrong trusting Italy. All the game is about is building trust and reputation, maintaining relationships, negotiating deals, arguing with the aim of persuading other players. Now, it is possible for you to play diplomacy online at www.deepgame.org. You can just create a game and start playing over a map and using instant messaging to negotiate with other players. And who are the other players? They can be either human players using the same tool or bots, that is, autonomous software agents that decide strategically what attacks to perform and that negotiate with you in a restricted language. You can develop one of these bots and by so doing, test the performance and fine-tune the parameters of your theoretical models of trust, reputation, negotiation or argumentation. If you want to develop a bot, you will find all necessary information and resources in the bot development section at www.deepgame.org. During AMAS, we'll demonstrate the usage of the testbed. We'll explain the technical details of a bot, Caramel Man 1, 
capable of playing the game using negotiation. Demo session visitors will choose to either observe a game played by instances of this bot, to play against them, or to compete against them and another visitor. The infrastructure of the testbed is fully operational. Visitors will be invited to join this open source effort and will be encouraged to develop their own bots. The Deep Game Testbed brings a unique opportunity to test and compare the most advanced multi-agent systems coordination models.